Well, um, <clears throat> playing Eric Harper, for sure, um, I feel like it, it allowed me to, like, revisit some certain things that maybe I, like, pushed past sure. or just, like, pushed aside sure. in my high school, in my, in my time during high school, and just, like, kind of revisit it and see, like, yo, there's some kids that you just, not some kids, but there's, like, people that you really need to like checking on and just be kind to just right because it's always it's very important to just be kind and it's always kindness to give everywhere right. and you just never know how far that can go sure. just by checking in on somebody and seeing how they're doing sure. you know so Vince uh, is really good at that too in real life you check, you in, check on in on everybody, everybody. yeah I, I make it a, a thing to check on really you don't check in on me uh, okay well <laughs> what up? how is Miss Carrie doing what is that about that's I check in I check in on Miss Walker I probably check on her more than anybody <laughs> He does. He's That's really good. good at that. So clearly the chemistry between everyone seems really great. I, what do you guys feel like was kind of the biggest challenges together facing some of the, the, the hard roles or kind of the plot line of the, of the story? Mm. Yeah, I mean, it's a super emotional show for all of us. I think we all had a lot emotionally to deal with mm -hmm. and staying in character and getting ready for these emotional scenes while also hanging out with some of like, your new best friends was definitely a challenge. It's so hard. It's so hard. It's so hard. Yeah, I think, <laughs> I think <laughs> um, yeah, what was really crazy was uh, we didn't really have that many days together, which mm -hmm. you might yeah. not know that because of how close we are, yeah. but we didn't have that many days together and I believe the day we did all of us <laughs> have a day together was the day where we had to most, go through most the most like the, the biggest part of the, sure. the show yeah. sure. and um, yeah it was so hard to just balance that like oh my gosh guys we're on a show and yeah. we're experiencing this life it was like, hard to balance but at the same time I feel like we were also supportive of each other in yeah, that 100%. like even if it was just someone else's coverage and you weren't on camera like these guys were giving me a hundred percent on the other sure. side to make sure that we all got the best performances out of each other like mm -hmm. everyone was really inspired by the stories that we're telling and knew how important it was and sure. didn't want to take that lightly so yeah. we had a really good time shooting it we're having a lot of fun talking about it now but we took it really seriously we're mm. really proud of how it came out yeah. that's incredible i love seeing miss carrie smile as she watches <laughs> you guys so yeah. You know, these are your mini gladiators now, right? They are. You know, so <laughs> what does it feel like to be behind the camera, Carrie, and to not, I mean, you're working now as an EP, so how does it feel to actually be in that space now versus... I have to say, I was saying this earlier that, you know, when Scandal first aired, there was all this talk about how it had been almost 40 years since there had been a black woman as the lead of a network sure. drama, and how that was shocking to the world, that our lead characters can look like somebody else, right. that we're not used to hearing their story. And sure. I think one of the things that's so powerful about this show is that you realize that every single person is the lead character of their own story, mm -hmm. and each one of those stories deserves to be told. Sure. So we take the idea of a protagonist and flip it on its head. Every single episode, we're telling you that a different person is the most important person in this story, because they are in their own lives. And that's true in our own lives, sure. for real. Sure. You know, that we have to be a more empathetic and compassionate society. We have to listen to each other and hear each other and know that each of us has a story and a life worth living. Do you feel like Facebook gave you that platform where you could really kind of voice that versus doing yeah, the like, typical big like screen? The, the Facebook watch, you know, structure of having these smaller episodes where we're getting so much story into like 10 minutes. Sure. Like I'm so proud of how packed each episode is with, with drama and fun and talent and story. It's just, it's a wonderful way to tell story and then telling it on the Facebook platform means that you're not just creating community around the show, but you're telling the content where the show, where community lives. You know, the, the story is in the place where community is. Sure. So that makes the conversation even easier.